everyone welcome to my youtube channel my name is omoye if you are seeing my face for the first time thank you so much for clicking on this video and thank you for subscribing to my youtube channel if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel please guys do the needful by subscribing to my youtube channel share and like my video and also do not forget to turn on your notification bell and whenever i upload the new video like this you guys will be the first to be notified so guys um i'll use this medium to thank each and every one of you that has been watching my video i really do appreciate you guys thank you so much and those that have been sus that have subscribed to my youtube channel so far please thank you so much thank you thank you thank you and also please share my videos please share my videos so that your friends your family can also benefit from my videos okay um how are you all doing how are you all doing happy christmas and happy new year in advance i hope you guys are doing well i hope you guys are safe out there so guys without wasting much of your time in this video i'll be showing you guys on how you can make your butt and hip enlargement oil okay so this oil i'm about to teach you guys is is very is a simple recipe and but it's very effective okay so um without much says and done because i won't want this video to be long so let's dive right into this to into the main reason of this video okay so let me take you guys to my working station and show you guys on how you can make this butt and hip alignment oil so let's go guys hi guys welcome back so um these are my instruments i'll be using this the the bowl i'll be using my cup this is my measuring cup i'll be making use of this and this is the phone i'll be using and this is my spoon and also my measuring spoon i'll be using so i'll be making use of my rubbing alcohol because i need to clean it up before i start um the mist okay so first of all i have to clean it off so that's what i'm doing and this is my rubbing alcohol guys if you're new to my youtube channel please subscribe to my youtube channel share and like my video do not forget to turn on your notification bell that whenever i upload a new video you guys will be the first to be notified okay so so that you'll be seeing more of my videos and also more of my upload so do not forget to do that thank you very much as you support me okay so once i clean up once i clean it up i'll be doing all the missing i'll be showing you guys the ingredients i'll be using in this recipe so so just keep watching okay just keep watching guys so so i'm done cleaning okay so this is what i'll be making use of so First of all, I'll be introducing all my ingredients I'll be using in this recipe. So, firstly, I'll be making use of my fenugreek seed. I'll be leaving a picture of it on the screen. So, this is my fenugreek seed powder, okay? I blended the powder myself. So, this is my fenugreek seed powder, okay? So, this is how it is okay so the next ingredient i'll be showing you guys is my maca root powder okay i'll also be leaving the picture of it on my screen for you to know it more properly so this is a maca root powder okay the next on my list is my fennel powder okay this is my fennel powder okay so i'll be making use of my fennel powder the next ingredient is my this is my clove powder okay i'll be making use of my clove powder i'll be leaving a picture as well on the screen so i blended it to this powder form okay so this is not the way i bought it in the market so 
I blended it to this powder form so you can as well do that or better still you can get the powder so this is my olive oil extra virgin olive oil so this is the oil i'll be making use of this is this will serve as my base okay so this is the oil i'll be making use of because i'll be infusing all the powders into the so guys um if you're getting um or um olive oil I'm sure you're getting the original olive oil okay so that you'll be getting all the benefits in it so i'll be making use of this uh, olive oil as my base also i'll be adding a uh, sweet almond oil so this is my sweet almond oil so i'll be making use of my sweet almond oil in this recipe the last is my container this is the container i'll be using so i'll be pouring or i'll be pouring it into this container so this is the container I'll be making use of okay so let's begin guys so first of all I'll be measuring out my my powders into this my measuring cup so firstly I'll go for go with um uh, mark our marker powder okay so I'll be making use of one tablespoon of our marker powder One tablespoon of our maca powder. So, guys, when it comes to um, uh, measuring the the powders you need, you can use as you can use any quantity of powder you want. Okay, so I'll be making use of one tablespoon of each of the powder. So it all depends on you what you want and how, the quantity of the powder you want to use okay so i'm making use of one tablespoon so if you can if you are if you want to also make use of one tablespoon no problem but if you're doing a large batch you have to make use of uh, more than one tablespoon okay guys i don't know if you understand so right here is my fenric powder so i'll be making use of one tablespoon of my fenric powder next on my list now is my fennel powder so i'll be making use of my one tablespoon of fennel powder fennel powder is very good when it comes to enlargement of the boob and also the enlargement of the of the breast okay so i'll be making use of one tablespoon of it as well So this is my clove powder so I'll be making use of half tablespoon of my clove powder so I'll be making use of this 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 half table half tablespoon so I'll be making use of half of it it's also good when it comes to firming and also enlargement of the boob and also the the breast so I'll be making use of half tablespoon So guys, right now I'll be adding my oils into it, okay? So, I'll be making use of uh, olive oil right now. So, I have to open it because it's sealed, okay? So, I'm the one opening it now. So, I have to... Okay? So, I'll be adding as much as I want into this powders, okay? So I'll be adding our oil into this powder. So I'll be adding a lot of it because I, I won't want a situation whereby my oil is not um, 
is not much on those powder and it will not that will affect the ingredient um the powders because it will not infuse properly okay so i'll be adding a lot of oils into it a lot of our uh, olive oil into it okay so for it to infuse properly okay so i'm okay with this okay so i'm okay with the quantity i got okay so this is okay so right now i'll be adding my sweet almond oil okay i'll be adding my sweet almond oil so i'll be adding one tablespoon of my sweet almond oil so right now i'm going to stir it together So guys, I need to add more of my oils because I need more oils into this recipe. So I'm adding more oil. So I'm okay right now with it. So right now you have to stir together, okay? So you have to tell together. So mind you guys, this is an illustration video. So I'm making a little badge. Okay, so this is a little quantity I'm making to show you guys on how you can make your enlargement oil. Okay, your hip and butt enlargement oil. Okay, so this just an illustration video okay so that's why i'm making a little batch of it to show you guys on how you can do that yourself so next now is to pour it into my container okay so after doing that i'll be i'll be placing this container on in my fridge okay for three days for it to i'll leave it in my fridge for three days sorry guys i'll leave it in my fridge for three days so each day you have to take it out and shake it and also place it back on your fridge so after three days you're free to use it okay so that's what i'll be doing here right now so I'll, after pouring it now i'll go and place it on my place it in my fridge for three days okay so each day every morning i have to shake it and place it back in the same position and leave it for that three days before making use of it so before then i'll be showing you guys on how you can massage it on your books okay and how you can use it because I know most people will be asking, how will I use it? How can I use it? How will I use it? So I'll be showing you guys that the same on. I'll be showing you guys in this video on how you can use it. So what I'm doing, I'm trying to sanitize the container. So that's what I'm doing. So so that's what I'm doing. So right now I'm going to trying it in my container okay
to put this one in another container so So guys, I have, I have to add, I have to pour this into this other container because it was not. Because it wasn't able to contain the other container, okay? So that's why I'm putting it into this container. So guys, these are what an e oil, okay? so this is the oil okay so right now what i will do here is i will place this two oil in my refrigerator okay for about three days so after three days i'll bring it out and voila i can use it okay but the reason why i ask you guys to place it on your fridge for three days for for the powder to infuse properly on our on our oil okay the oil we use in this recipe so that's the reason why i ask you to keep it in your fridge you can keep it in any cold place for three days okay after three i didn't say you should go and put it in your deep freezer please do not quote me i said put it in your fridge there's difference between fridge and deep freezer or freezer for it to infuse properly okay so after every each day you can bring it out and shake it and place it back okay so after the three days you can start making use of it okay so in this video i'll be showing you on how you can use it okay so i'll be making use of this this the same is the same okay just the one that remain in this con in this um measuring cup so i'll be using this as an illustration so these are assuming this is our boot okay so and i'll show you how you can massage it so once you finish taking your bath in the morning or in the evening you want to massage it so this is how you massage it you apply the oil on your boots okay you apply the oil on your boots like this then what you should how you massage it is this if you're massaging it massage it upward this way okay from the down to the off like this don't bring it down like this no Take it up like this okay i don't know if you understand you guys understand what i'm trying to say if you're massaging your boots like you massage from the down up from down up from down up okay do not massage this way because massaging it this way you're flattening your boot your your boots okay you're flattening your boots so massage it from up from down up down up down up okay so that's the way you massage it you massage the side like this like this like this the same way you know what will i how will i explain it the same way i don't know if you guys have seen where the uh where our parents normally like if you give birth to a newborn baby the way our parents normally um clip their bum bum like ma massage their bum bum so that's the same way you do on yours okay so you just massage it upward not downward okay so that's the way you massage this oil and that's how you use it okay so guys um i guess i guess you got guys understand what i'm trying to say in this video so hi guys welcome back thank you so much for watching this video if you're watching this video to this extent thank you so much for watching this video to this extent thank you so so much and please if this video was helpful please do give it a good thumbs up and also do not forget to um, share this video to your friends and family okay so guys there is something i forgot to say in this video okay remember i told you guys to place this um oil in your refrigerator for three days okay after uh in your, in your refrigerator for three days after placing it in your refrigerator for the three days the third day before you start using it you first of all have to sieve out the ingredient away from the oil okay before you start using the oil but better still you can as well leave it that way and use it it all depends on you the way you want it okay if you want to use it that this way like you don't want to sieve it you want to just use it this way 
you it, you're good to go you can use it this way but if you don't want to use it this way you want to separate the separate the ingredient from the oil you can also do it that way it all depends on you what you want so guys please do not forget to share this video okay and also if you have any question like i said earlier please leave it on the comment section below and i will attend to all your questions thank you so much guys and i'll see you all in my next video bye